Om Shanti, welcome you have the 26th of September's Godly Blessing. We have been talking for a couple of days about being courageous, being having thoughts of overcoming Maya, that means weaknesses within us, or having a flying stage, or becoming a jewel in God's heart, or becoming a jewel, or becoming God, father's companion, friend, equal to him, and many more things which we've been learning. And today we are talking about not just zeal and enthusiasm, but we are talking about courage. So God is giving us methods to inculcate various virtues which are required as it is in daily life for our worldly things. But we also need it in our spiritual life. We need courage. We need enthusiasm. We need zeal. We need to have self-reflection. We need to have self-talk. We need to have meditation remembrance of god and here god says that may you be a courageous soul so we need courage also who makes maya lose her courage that means the weakness within us loses courage to overcome our thoughts with the thoughts of courage so there's a tussle within us between good and evil and god says that with courage you can overcome the evil and even evil will lose courage to overcome you. So God says the children who have one strength and one support have courageous thoughts of definitely having to be victorious. This is because when you children have courage, you definitely experience the father's help. So if I am courageous, if I am going on the right path, if I have not made any kind of trouble for anybody else, then obviously I am on the right path. When you have courage, you become worthy of receiving help from even the creator but if we are going against the flow that means we are going towards the satanic thoughts then even god can't help us so when you have courage you become worthy of receiving help when facing thoughts of courage maya loses her courage because if somebody is saying you should be very angry at this point of time you should take revenge and instead of you feeling revengeful you feeling angry at that time because of somebody else telling you something if you're calm, composed, automatically you have, through courage, overcome Maya. So those who have weak thoughts and think, I do not know whether this will happen or not. I don't know whether I will be able to do this or not. Such thoughts invoke Maya. That means you create chain of thoughts of weaknesses. You create chain of thoughts of negativity. So therefore constantly have thoughts filled with zeal, enthusiasm and courage. And you will then be called a courageous soul. And that is what we learn in Brahma Kumaris, that how to inculcate the power of courage. And see, courage is something which can only come when you have a clean and clear pathway, you have a complete pure goal, You there is a selfless goal, there is no selfishness, there is no I, me, myself, there is no need of name and fame, you are not thinking about those things, you are not thinking of worldly attainments. And that's where the courage comes. And how do you get that? How do you get onto that line is what you learn in Brahma Kumaris on a daily basis. I'm sure you with this.